Again, from undrafted rookie to now NFL starter, where's your confidence level now? Um, we talked to Aaron Glenn yesterday, and he said uh, he really likes the things he's seen out of you. Um, I got to scream a lot of confidence uh, from just just coming in the league um, and just working hard. Been knowing that I was undrafted, and I got to work is much harder than the other guys, and just keep pushing. And uh, I feel like I got a, a lot of confidence even with playing. So you know, everybody's got a dream when they come in, obviously. Uh, but was this? Your dream, did you foresee this, that you'd be a guy who's uh, an NFL starter at cornerback for a playoff team? Oh uh, Yeah, of course. Um, uh, I always wanted to get a Super Bowl ring. I know in college I didn't win as much. Um, I came from a winning team, like in high school, um, pop one and stuff like that. So I had a couple of down years in, in college. We, we lost a lot. And just coming to um, a, a, a group that's always got a legendary quarterback and um, – um, advancing to the playoffs and stuff, it's, it's just a dream come true. How good do you feel about this secondary unit? You got to have yourself. You have Marshawn, you have Marcus Williams, now you have Kurt Coleman, and you got Patrick Robinson, so you've got a lot of quality players there and a lot of quality depth. Um, I feel like um, we're ready to take the next step, even with the young guys that are coming along. Now um, we we pushing each other, each other as a group. And, um, with guys like Marshawn, you said, um, uh, win a rookie of the year. Um, it only motivates uh, the other guys and even the rookies and stuff to, to try to get that accolade. So I feel like um, we're doing a good job so far. And, um, we just got to keep chopping up. Yeah, kind of strange to hear you say the younger guys because now you're a three-year vet, though. Mm -hmm. So you are one of the veteran yeah. guys in this secondary. Um, what's it like to kind of assume that role? Um, I say uh, I still I still sometimes I feel like I'm I'm young I'm I'm younger than them. You know, you so because um, we joke a lot. But I feel like, uh, yeah, with me um, setting the tone for these, these young, younger guys and um, these guys wanting to get to where we at, and, um, I feel like it, it's, it's doing good. And it's, a good it's a good challenge, and point two. Yeah. Do you feel like you have a story to tell? Have you kind of taken some of the younger guys aside and told them what your story is about, you know, hey, I was undrafted, but look at me now? No, I only did that to Marshawn. <laughs> That's my little, my little bro. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, even when he came in last year, I feel like uh, I didn't – Kind of told them what it was. I know we we didn't have. I feel like we, last year we didn't have that leadership in the group um, with the older guys. And um, this year it, it turned to something different. Um, guys, younger guys stepping up also. So I feel like everything is coming coming together, and they just young guys just following our lead.